Hi, Pat, Pat here. here. I have I got an Akai, Akai cassette deck model CS703D. Uh, when I first got this, I wasn't getting nothing on the left meter. So I put a blank tape in and just pushed up and down on the record switch. The switch is always a problem. But now, all the channels are working. But it is making a little noise. I don't know if you can hear that. I think that should be a little quieter. And I'm sure the belts need some attention. So I'm going to take the cover off and take a look at the inside. This cover here, it's got a big space right there. Doesn't look like it's quite meeting up right there. And the other side's nice and tight. So I'm kind of wondering. Somebody's probably been inside this up once already. Here's the inside of this thing. Right there is where the 110 comes in. I'll get some electrical tape over that. Just so I don't reach in and shock myself. And you can see all the belts here. They all look pretty well used up. And right here is that play record switch. Just about every deck I've worked on. That switch is always a problem and needs to be cleaned. I did manage to get the mechanism out. I had to snip a couple wires, but I'll splice those back in. Just make it easier to move around. So I'll start taking this plate off to get to this belt. And I don't know what it's going to take to get to that belt there. I did take this apart a little bit. I got this main pulley out. I took the motor out so I clean this pulley there. And I use a little bit of this stuff. Just get a little drop of oil in there. And right inside there, this little rubber wheel. And I use a little bit of this stuff. Clean up, give it a little better grip. I got the mechanism put back in and I did go ahead and shoot some dioxin in these pods here and these switches and this play record switch. I cleaned and treated this pinch roller so it's in pretty nice shape now and the heads got a little demagnetizer so I went ahead and demagnetized the heads while I was in here. There's the adjustment pod right inside of there. Get a little screwdriver in there, adjust the speed. And I like to see 3000. And it's holding pretty close. This plastic piece just popped right off this cover with no problem. And I'll take something like this and it does a nice job of cleaning it up and polishing it. And this one will just pop right back on. And hinges back right on there and it's looking good. I got blank tape in and I'm doing a little recording. Meters are working good. Controls respond well. Back up a little bit. Let's see how it sounds. I got store bought tape playing now. And it's sounding pretty good. This little deck came out pretty nice. Thanks for watching the video.